recording. Okay, so I am in the mood to make some wine. So in the two gallon jug, I have a mesh bag filled with cut up papaya, mint leaves, and orange watermelon. So it's about four, a little over four pounds of fruit and mint together and I've mixed it with the necessary um, ingredients which is the yeast nutrients the cambian tablet the acid blend the tannin and the pectid enzyme and I'm going to get my sugar water in here next once it's cooled down a little bit and then I am going to stir up the ingredients really well I'll let it sit for 24 hours and after it sits for 24 hours I will go ahead and put the champagne yeast and let it start to ferment all right so we got it at about 12 percent alcohol content so that's kind of where i want it and then we're going to close this off and let it sit for 24 hours all right so it's been officially 24 hours and i am going to add the yeast What am I looking at, basically? So, without dropping it in. All right, so that is the papaya, the watermelon, and the mint. So we're gonna just saturate the fruit, and then we're gonna sprinkle the yeast right on top. And we're gonna stir it in the next seven days, make sure the yeast does its job and it starts the fermentation process. Right there. I'm hold that down just a little bit. Keep it steady. Keep it steady. I'm going to use half of this because it's technically good for five gallons. So push that down. Just sprinkle right on top. I suppose it'll make the wine taste like wine. Yes. So, and then I'm just going to leave it like that. Put that all in there. I'm going to waste the wine yeast. We will check back in 24 hours. And then by then it should start bubbling. Put that right back on the counter. And we'll check back. All right, so we are about to rack it from the jug into the carboy. And this took about a couple minutes and it netted us a full carboy jug and two quarts. So we will check back in 30 to 45 days. Hit that like, subscribe button. Thank you. Bye.